not discipled, you are not growing. And because you are not growing, you are still a, a baby, therefore you are living in the flesh. It is growth, spiritual growth, that helps us not to live in the flesh, but in the spirit. That's why sometimes you have Christians born again for 10 years, but any time he speaks, he speaks like a worldly person because he's still in the flesh. This is why when we, it comes to interpersonal relations, most Christians, they relate like heathens. How they do one to another. How they talk one of one another because we have not grown. It easily manifests when we are challenged, especially when there is a challenge. That is when you are going to see the level of the growth of this person. When you are not discipled, then you are a baby. You are a baby. You are a baby. Paul rebuked the church of Corinth. Said, you guys, some of you say they belong to me. Others say they belong to Apollo. Look at that. He said, you guys, you are still in the flesh. He said, when I came unto you, I could not talk to you as spiritual, but as carnal. Because you are still babies. So the church is a center of discipleship. I sat under the ministry of Apostle John for that time. And let me tell you, I, I got to, knew, to know many things about the work of faith. About the work of faith. About the work of faith. Why I was discipled. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. It is in that process of discipleship that people grow. Why? Because in church, I'll give you pastors who will do what? They will feed you with knowledge and understanding. Jeremiah 3 verse 15. Discipleship happens easily because you have, that is where you have the pastors. It is in church where you have pastors. I've just told you that pastors are not people that just stand. They are people that are appointed by God, separated. And he says, and I'll give you pastors according to my heart, which shall feed you with knowledge and understanding. 